Good morning, Freda. Okie dokie, so grab two tins. I went for minestrone this week, gave mum the, the vegetable tins. Grab your juice so you can get that if you need it. Grab a chair, have a flat space of wall, and we will get going. Okie dokie. So let's get started. Get my music on. Move that out of the way just now because I don't need my chair. And knowing me, I will trip over it and fall probably. So I'll just put the camera down a wee bit so that you can actually see me. There we go. Okay, so we're starting off very much. It's not the time to relate to me up. Okay, so tap. Just spread the arms nice and easy. Marching, roll the arms. Just packing the feet up, roll the arms up, and up. Other way, roll. Take it up, and up. Okay, if you've got space, you're going to walk forward, and then we clap, and back. If you've not got space, I just march on the top. Four forward and four back. Three heel left, three heel left, three heel left, and back. I'll see you next week. Face to the side of you. We're going to do two shifts. We're just going to shift and up. Or back to the garden. You can have a good job there in the nice weather. Well, she's not immune. One more each side. Oh, allies. And march. I'll see box step, three more ways, and narrow. You alternate, so change in each turn. So tap and change. If you can, add the allies, punch in the front. Take a half left and up. She was not looking at you. I'm just grabbing it. And march. Okay, we're going to turn the toes out. We're going to march it nice and wide. Open up our hips and bring it back in. And take it out. Mom just came to go under to get our phone. And bring it back in. So this is going to be lively started. Okay, take it to your heel deck and bite it curl. What's up, my right? Just that heel in. When you do your heel deck, you want to bend the leg that you're standing on. Okay, that's warm up the muscles. In the Okay, toe tap and chest this. Okay, we're going to go one out, one up, out and up. We're going to go out, up to the side. Out, up, side. Out, up. And up. Take your toe tap to the side now, so tap to the side. Again, bending that leg you're standing on, keeping the heel on the ground of the foot that you're standing on as well. Keep tapping, lift the arm. Okay, so just keep bending the elbow, lifting the arm in line with the shoulder. Both arms, up. Stand up nice and slow. All the way. If you can't get your arms out up, don't worry, just go as high as you can. So on there, we're going straight into the toe tap behind. Off we go, passing the toe. Again, bend that leg, just standing on, warming up the leg muscles. Up. 
Okay, you want to make it hard there? Catch the face and reach the front. Reach back as you can. And then. Okay, bend in that leg to the side. Go tap in front, one out, up, face. And march out. Forward for four, right, six, three, two. Oh, okay, wait, you call it. Oh, hello, Jean. Not really sleeping, she's like peering with her eyes open as if to say, Excuse me. Just step, one, two, two, three, 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 two, we don't want it flat and out, so it's directly up to the bottom. We put, we don't forget to do it, we put it out. High knees. Because I've got all the doors shut for the noise. It's too warm in here, and it's all quite the heat, but not for too long. Second punch, no. Remember when you're tacking, you want to soften the knee. Don't drop kick. Okay, so don't force it. Just a bit gentle kick. And march. Okay, we're going to see how we're going to pack. Having a dirty side bend. Right, so stand up nice and tall. Down. And up. Other side. Down. And up. Just feel the stretch. And up. And up. One more. And last. Oh, so you feeling a bit warmer? Well, I am. I hope you all are. So, grab a wee bit and we'll get started with our main exercise. Okay, jumpy. So, first exercise is squat or set to stand. So, Two options. You can either stand and squat, so heels down, pushing the bottom back and then. So come back, keep the chest up, or you do your set to stand. Okay? So let's just remember sitting down and then pushing back up. Okay? So when we're ready, we'll get on the time up. Let's go. So squatting. Or doing your set to stand. So it's working the same muscle. Obviously, when you're doing your set to stand, you're sketching that wee rest at the bottom. But you're still working all these big muscles in the legs. Just make sure that you're pushing through your heels. Squeeze in the bottom when we get to the top. Ooh, keep going. Squeeze. So remember, it doesn't matter how low you can go, go as low as you can, but without leaning forward. Okay? So if you can only get to there by pushing your bum back, that's fine. Although if that was the case, 
and the belly you are doing set to stand. Really sure going all the way down to the chair then. Oh, one more. Woo, max it out. It's not me. Okay, same again. Give the legs a big shake. Ready? Let's go. And up. Oh, I can see somebody's just joined in, but I can't see this. Jane, hello. What well, in? So now they're squatting and we're doing sets of stands for those that have joined us. Ooh, feel the burning legs. Push the bum back, keep that tummy nice and tight, keep your chest up. One more. Ooh. Well done. Keep the legs moving. Whatever you do, don't just stop and stand still. Always keep moving. Whether it's your hands, your feet, just keep the blood going. All right. So, next. We're going to go and do a wall press. So, flat bit of walk, hands in line with the chest, and when you come down, your chest comes to your hands. So, hands on the wall, feet out. When you come into the wall, your heels will come off the ground slightly. Okay, that's fine. You want to come down at a nice straight angle. Ready? Off we go. Keep going, so push in, that wall away from you. Push. I really need to do it one day, my camera's facing the wall, so you can't just see the back of me. You just keep going. I just want to turn my back on. I could put it against the window, but that's not going to push the window out, so I'm not going to try that. And stop there. Give your arms a wee shake, keep marching. We're going to do that once more. Oh, it starts warming here. Okay, so back to your wall press. So make sure when you're going down, your chest comes into the hands. All right, and your chest and your hips go together. Okay, don't be leaving your bum behind. Ready? Three, two, one. one. Let's go. Okay. And if you want to make it harder. You bring your feet further away from the wall, so you've got a bigger range of movement. Keep going. Keep going. So pressing against that wall. One more. And stop there, give your arms a wee shake, well done. Okay, grab your chair. We're going to do lunges. So, I'll sit there so you can see. So remember, when you're doing your lunges, the chair's only there for balance. It is not there to push off of, okay? No cheating. I know you like some of you. So, the chair should be diagonally in front, so that when you step forward, it's then beside you, just in case you did wobble and you needed to grab onto it, all right? If your balance is okay, try not to use the chair, okay? Let's go. So we're going to step, bend, push through the heel together, other leg. So we're alternating legs, keeping the shoulders back. When you step forward, we don't want to think about going any further forward. You want to think about sinking down, so dropping that back knee. So the back heel comes off the ground. But you're driving through this front heel. Shoulders back. Remember your chair's there for support if you do need it, but just make sure you're not pushing off the chair because we're wanting to work the legs. We're not using the arms to push on the chair. Purely there for balance. One more. And march out. 
Have your legs reach back. Give them again. Move it. Okay, still not move. I'm just rocking our smooth and okay. okay, let's go back to lunges. Off we go. Stepping and dropping down. So that knee, once we do that front heel, don't let it come forward. So it doesn't matter if you can get right down. Perfect. If you're only doing a wee bend, perfect. As long as you're working to your ability. Okay. Ooh, keep going. Keep going. I'm going to come see if we'll get 31 people. Oh, well, hello, Harley. Keep going. Still got a couple more. Left hand. Ooh. And stop the yummy match. Well done. Okay, grab your chins, look the beans. I've, I've opted for the minestrone today. Okay, going a bit heavier with the pasta, you know. All right, so give me a couple of seconds, don't grab tins if you've not got them yet. Doesn't need to be two tins, it can be bottles of water, bags of sugar, doesn't need to be anything, you can just do it with your hands, completely up to you. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to keep our feet moving and we're just going to do bicep curls. So we're bringing the tins of the water up almost to the shoulder, but we don't want to touch the shoulder because we want to keep the elbow locked into our side. Okay, so I'll show you from the side. You're going up and then all the way down. We're not doing any mini movements, all the way down. One at a time. Add a wee heel down. Keeping the back nice and straight, don't lean forward. Okay, we're going to go for bicep curl and to shoulder face. All right, if you've got any kind of blood pressure issues, maybe just stick to the bicep curls. All right, if not, we're going to curl and press. So up, out, press, and down. Make sure you're breathing, don't hold your breath. My problem is I can't stand still. Something always needs to move, whether it's my feet or my bobble head. Keep going. Up, out, press, and in. In, in. And. Okay, we're going to do the same again. So we're starting off with the bicep curls. And then either continue with bicep curls or bicep curl onto shoulder press. Three, two, one, let go. So heel down and curl. Heel down and curl. Remember, we want to control it in the way down. I don't want this. I'm going to say I don't want to see this, but I can't see anything, so I'm just trusting this. Okay, so nice and controlled in the way down. One at a time. Ready for your curling press? We go. Up. Out. Press. And out. In. And out. Up. If you can, we're going to do eight, seven, six, keep breathing, five, Four, three, two, one, and relax. Well done. Keep your toes. We're going to tap to the side. And we're going to do some punches. Punching in front. Working the shoulders a wee bit in the chest. Working Punch across. Make sure when you're punching out and punching across, you want to keep your tummy muscles nice and tight because as you put the weight forward, your body wants to fall forward, but your core is stopping it. So engage the tummy muscles. Up. 
Punching France. And march, well done. Okay, what have we got next? We'll do some triceps, hip back. So that was way there, so that was super good looking. So we're going to do triceps, hip back, and we'll go straight into some shoulder circles. All right, so your 10, lift the 10, it's facing forward. Elbows back, and we're going to kick back and squeeze. So the elbow doesn't move, you're just hinging. So we're squeezing. So when you go back, think about squeezing that muscle at the back of the arm, your triceps. Or as some people like to say, the bend wings. You can keep the toes tapping, make sure you're breathing. Squeeze it. Okay, from there, left, up, and start to. Other way. Other way. Other way. And relax. Give your shoulders a wee shrug. Arms a wee wriggle. Same again. Okay, so hands facing forward, but nah, at the back of the hip. We're not bringing it here. Ready? Hips back and squeeze. So don't swing it. We want to lift, squeeze, and in. Up, squeeze, and in. And the shoulders back. Feeling it burning? I am. Take it up and circle. Oh, feeling it this time. Still not doing anything. And another way. Feel the burn. Keep those feet moving. Change, other way. Other way. Other way. And relax. Well done. Take it away. Okay, grab your chair. We're going to do some leg raises and some calf raises. Okay, so we're going to work the hips. Muscle right about the hips. Get them nice and strong. And then we're going to work on the calf muscles. All right. So, chair. Balance the legs. We're not leaning on it, because what some people are like. So, fingertips at that, all right? So, we're going to do eight, seven. You want to keep that foot hovering off the ground. Five, four, three, two. Same leg, we're going to kick back. So, we want to keep the leg straight, and we want to squeeze the bum. Squeeze it. So it's coming from the bum, that's what's lifting the leg. We're not bending that knee too much. Three, three, two, one. Other side. Back here. We're going for side raises. Three, two, one. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five. So remember. Try and keep that foot hovering. Good. One, cast it back. Squeeze. So squeeze that butt cheek. Keep the tummy nice and tight. Try not to lean forward. Okay, from there, we're going to go cast raises. So pushing up onto the big toe in the second toe. Again, chairs there for balance. So I've just moved it to the side. So you can see my feet, but ideally you want to be behind it so you can put both hands on it. Alright? Sorry, if I talk over it, it's fine. 
I don't want you to talk all over. So push through that big toe in the second toe, remember. Feel it burn in the calf. Don't let your heel bump down either. It literally should just touch and then you're back up. Three more. Then we're going straight back into the leg raises. Ready? Go. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Keep the hip forward. That means your toe is facing forward. Hit back, same leg. Squeeze the bottom. Feel it burning. Other leg to the side. Head forward. Get back. Please go with them. Four more. Relax the foot, don't put it, you won't be able to get it flat. So relax it, and 
and then lean forward. Okay, so that's your seated option or we're standing. Ooh. I can see if we're sitting down for a little bit. Okay, we're going to lift the toe up. So if you're seated, you're just doing the same. You're lifting the toes to your nose. Feel it stretched in your calves. Yes. She's not happy. Okay. okay, other leg, front foot flat, bend the back leg. And remember, if you're seated, just relax the foot. Don't worry about putting it flat on the ground. So bend that back leg, take your bum out, hands onto the bent knee, and feel that stretch in the hamstring. So keep the back nice and flat. What we don't want to be doing is arching the back or curving it. We want to keep it nice and flat, stick the bum out, feel that stretch. Now lift the toe up, so bring your toes to your nose. Whether you're seated or standing. Actually not moved at all. Guarantee as soon as I finish, she'll be like, oh hi. Okay, bring it up. Knee marked. Alright, so we're gonna do a wee stretch for the quads in your hip. So if you can, you're gonna grab your foot. Alright. So we should all be standing up for this one if we can. So you can chair for balance, all right? If you cannot get a hold of your foot and bring, oops, and bring it up so you feel that stretch, what I want you to do is use the chair, toe on the ground, knee forward, hip forward. So you're tucking the hips under as long as you're feeling stretched in the front of your hip. Okay, so either toe on the ground and bring, pushing that forward or lift it, you look behind. You can also do it by putting your foot on a chair, but ideally you would want two chairs for that, just for your balance. Other side, so either toe behind, hips forward, or grab the foot. And we want knee to knee, heel to bum, hips forward. Oh, this side's tighter. Must have done more than this side. Okay. So I'll just show you quickly if you can't. If you wanted to do it on a chair, you can do it that way. All right, and it just saves you having to hold your foot. Okay. Okay, we march. Now we're there. So, feet just slightly further than hip width apart. Move that out of the way so I don't hit my hand off it. We're going to do a big deep breath in. Stretch up at the top. And we're going to breathe out. Breathe in. And out. Breathe in. Breathe in. As you breathe out, bring your hands together. We're going to do a slight twist to the centre, other side, centre, and more. Centre. Take deep breath in. Great. Hands together. Well done. That's you. We're all done. We did run a bit later, but we didn't start until a couple of minutes later, so plus I talk too much. I talk to my dogs too much. Yeah, you can see me? Yeah. Yeah. She's sunbathing. She's like, eat it costly. Okay, okay. I hope you've enjoyed it. Remember and leave me a wee comment if you joined in. Um, if you want to see other exercises, different exercises, please comment and let me know. I will see them. So I'm always watching. Okay, okay, I will see you next Wednesday for the chair based exercises and next Thursday for the keep that low again. Okay, take care and stay safe. Bye.